Right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. We've got lots of football shirt content coming for you over the weekend, over the next few weeks. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Today, we're looking at, and tomorrow, we're looking at retro shirts from zvbestone.com. The best place, I think, right now to get your fake football shirts from. I've got three shirts to show you today, three shirts to show you tomorrow, all retro, and at the same time, all under £20. Takes about two to three weeks to come as well, so not that long in terms of delivery from, like, China all the way across to the UK. If you want to ask any other further questions, by all means, put them down in the comments, or alternatively, join my Discord. There's over 2,000 people in there now regularly talking about football shirts, so go Check it out. Are we ready to look at some real Madrid classic football shirts? Let's go. So the first one is from, I think, the 1996-1997 season. They always come bagged up. Now, on all shirts for today and tomorrow, I have done printing just to show you the quality of name and number on the back. There is There has been a massive improvement in terms of the quality of the printing. The logos and the badges and stuff on the front are generally fine. In the past, names and numbers, not generally with ZV Best, but from buying sort of like fake shirts from various companies haven't been great, but they have really stepped up their game over the last few months. I think it's been the one thing that's let them down. So let's see what the quality is like. So 1996, 1997, nice and thin. There we go. Real Madrid, Kelmer, embroidered badge, subliminal print for the uh, logo and sponsor. We've got the dog patch on the front and on the back we've got our uh, Carlos. Roberto Carlos. There we go, yeah. The name and number does feel a lot thicker, a lot better in quality than what they maybe did over a year ago. It's got the old La Liga logo on as well. That's a subliminal print as well, so that's not going to come off in extra large. It's a really nice shirt. So there's the first one, 96, 97. It's got the dog patches on, the dog paw patches on the side as well. Can you see that? There you go. That's the first one, Real Madrid, 96, 97. Okay, the next one, we're moving into the early 2000s, the Galactico era. We've gone with an away one this time. Um, probably my, oh yeah, oh, I can't decide. You're probably my favourite player growing up as a kid. It's the OG. Remember when he came to Old Trafford and absolutely ripped Manchester United apart. And I think they actually wore this shirt. There you go. Real Madrid, Siemens on, embroidered on badge and Adidas with the Siemens Mobile printed on, really nice thick, and on the back, there you go, Ronaldo, the original Ronaldo, number 11, once again, really good print, nice, nice, plain kit, I think I'm going to keep that one for myself, it is in large, but that, my friends, is an absolute belter, an absolute classic, shirt number two, Real Madrid, 2002-2003, tw uh, away shirt. And the last one, we're moving into the 2010s, 2011, sort of like the second area, the other Ronaldo, we've got him on the back, and I think this is my favourite shirt from this era, I think it's the mixture of the just the classic white and the purple, there you go, this one is in extra large, would fit Slim, extra large, or a large as well. Once again, really good quality on the print. As you can see. And on the back, the name and numbering as well from that area. When you get the retro shirts, they do do a really good job in matching up the name and number from that era. All right, guys, so that's three shirts from Real Madrid. Tomorrow, we're going to look at three from Barca. Let me know down in the comments which of your three is your favourite. If you've got any other suggestions in terms of Real Madrid kits, put them down in the comments. Check out ZV Best as well. Really good in terms of getting up-to-date shirts. So the new arrivals, as you can see, let's go new arrivals. Let's see what's new in. Okay, there's a couple of 24, 25 shirts already coming out. They've got the Stone Roses Manchester United collection as well, so really cool. Drip feeding with a bit of uh, Japanese football. There's loads of concept shirts, international shirts ahead of the Euros as well. I'm doing a video on that very, very soon. So make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Thanks, guys. Take care. See you tomorrow.